You know them. You love them. Lightsaber crystals. Jedi would find naturally forming crystals in places like the caves on Dantooine or Ilum, but in both Legends and Canon, there were some pretty distinct differences in the crystals that Jedi and Sith used. Jedi would take a very nature-based approach, finding crystals in various deposits throughout the galaxy. In Legends, most Sith would use synthetic crystals, due to existing in the shadows and Jedi frequenting natural deposits. This was often seen as a shortcut to creating a lightsaber, and was frowned upon by Jedi of certain eras. Luke Skywalker's lightsaber actually used a synthetic crystal because he was unaware that natural deposits existed, since Palpatine had many of these sites destroyed. Imperial Knights used synthetic crystals for various reasons. Imperial Knights were a lot more uniform and showed less individuality, hence their silver blades, marking them as distinct from the Sith or Jedi. In canon, kyber crystals by default are attuned to the light side of the Force and have some form of sentience. Sith would have to bleed kyber crystals to give them their red hue, asserting dominance over them and bending it to their will, corrupting it in the same way the Sith corrupt the Force by using the dark side. Do you prefer Sith using synthetic crystals or bleeding crystals? Let us know in the comments.